everyone! Good morning! Welcome in and happy... Oh! Oh! Grimer Studio is serving for 20 more months. <gasps> 20 months already. Whoop oh whoop. my goodness! Arish love left areish love right areish dance. Bema, thank you so much for the 20 month resub. Holy moly. 20 months! Four months and you'll be at two years! Two years, Grandma! Holy cow! Thank you so much! Welcome once again to the Office of Shade Slayer group, even though you never officially left. Welcome. Welcome. So welcome in, everybody! Happy Monday! Happy Monday! How is everybody's Monday going so far? Whether it's morning, afternoon, evening, or night, whatever time of day it is for you. It'll be two years anniversary. Yeah, that's true. That's true. That's in August. Oh my gosh. Wow. Hello from someone who went to Anime Japan 2024 convention. How did that go, Maddie? Hope that went well. Well, welcome in. Impulse Screama, Danny, Squid James, Beat, Saint Seiya, Bray Jared. Welcome in, Metal Spider Deck. Maddie, welcome in, everybody. How's your Monday going so far? Time for more Saiyan's dad jokes. Yes, it is. I took a nap earlier. Oh, that was nice. Sometimes you need a good nap. Sometimes you need a good nap. How's it going, though? It's going good for me. I've had a pretty productive morning so far. I think. If I can... Yeah. Pretty productive. Just listening to some music? Ooh. What kind of music? Trapped on the porch with a dog sleeping on me. Oh! Hopefully it's not like dead of winter for you, Impulse. Oh goodness. Maladrag, welcome in. I need that stuff. Hey, yeah. If you got work, you got school, you got work, you gotta get that extra sleep sometimes. I have just one thing to say. What's that? Yesterday was my brother's birthday? Well, happy belated birthday to your brother! I hope he had a good day. I hope he had an excellent birthday. Oh, goodness me. I have my water with me today. Just a bit of Nightwish. <gasps> nice. Nightwish is good. Nightwish is good. Ah, oh, goodness me. I have been a busy little bee writing, though. I'm finally done with the second part of my Professor Layton AU. Ah! <laughs> yes. Uh, the metal pipe seems to have uh, fully woken me up, even though I was already awake. <laughs> Their version of Phantom of the Opera. Oh yeah! It's good. How are you doing today? I'm doing good! Best anime convention ever? Let's go! Does it involve metal pipes? No, it does- well, Not falling on anybody's head, but there are some metal pipes involved. Not any falling on anybody's head, though. <laughs> Arya sings Disney songs? I have sung Disney songs, uh... Before. Not being not me being excited for Acheron's release this week. Yeah, I need to finish Penacony. I need to finish the Penacony story before then. I need to do that. I'm probably gonna be doing that later today. Later today and er, and if I don't finish it today, probably early tomorrow. Hunting Griffin! Welcome in! Welcome in! I can't speak. Pardon me. La 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 la. Welcome in! <laughs> Oh, goodness. Hope you're having a good Monday so far, Griffin. Loved it so much that I dashed to the spots on the convention so fast that my family members that came along lost me and starved so much. Oh my gosh. 
They lost you? Goodness me. I've only gone to one anime convention ever, but I absolutely had a blast. I, um... I went to a VA panel, and there was, uh, Rika Fajardo, which was Mirio Togata's VA. Um, there was Klee's VA. Um, there was... Uh... Ah, Lady Dimitrescu's VA, so... From Resident Evil 8, I think. And then Xander Mobius who is uh, Joker and the announcer for Smash Brothers. So, yeah. It was a pretty cool experience. And I got to get a signature from uh, J. Michael Tatum, which was super fantastic. I would love to go to another one and get more signatures and talk to more VAs because I kind of want to pick their brain a little bit about their work because it's fantastic. I don't regret a single thing. Oh, well, that's good. I'm glad you don't regret a single thing. I'm glad. It's supposed to be an enjoyable experience. <sighs> Wish I could do that, but I can never find conventions like that near me. Oh, I see. They do tend to be pretty locational. I live where there are a lot of conventions pretty frequently, so I actually have to look and see what ones are around in the summer. I'd love to see what American cons are like. French are tiny, kind of tiny in comparison. Oh yeah! Ah! Goodness me! All the metal pipes this morning. I'll be going to an anime and video game festival around June. Oh, that's fun! I'll have to look and see what's around during the summer. So maybe I can save up and go to one. That would be fantastic. It had so many exhibitions. My Hero Academia, Demon Slayer, Konosuba, Oshino Ko, Classroom of the Elite, ReZero, plenty of way more. Those are the highlights. Goodness me, yeah. Japan certainly doesn't skip out on the conventions. They're huge. And I thought American conventions were big. Good morning, Mega Rock. Welcome in. How's your Monday so far? Alrighty, though. Let's go ahead and get into this game here because I'm excited. We, we gotta go through Hotland here. Bum, bum. Bum, bum. It is time to go through Hotland. Almost slept in, almost forgot about class. Oh my goodness. Yeah, don't forget about class. Class is important. Alright. We are in the Hotland. Is Undyne standing on Pappy's head? Oh yeah. Undyne, get off of Pappy's head. That's dangerous. I know. Hey, Danny, congrats on that seven weeks that seven week streak. Oh. What the heck, Alphys? <laughs> I hate using the phone. I don't want to do this, Lamau. Really? Undyne. I mean Alphys, language. Oh. Soon. <laughs> I forgot about this. I forgot about the Sunder plane. You tell Sunder plane it has a powerful rudder. Ow. <laughs> Approach. You get close to it, but not too close. Eh? Human? Oh, I did it! Woo! And I got 60 gold from doing that. Yay! A talking plane? Huh? 
Well, it shouldn't be too surprising at this point. OMG. I've had my claw over the last Giga for five minutes. Alphys, my goodness. Oh, I'm just gonna do it. I'm just gonna call. Alright. Oh. Blake? Whoever was calling hung up before you answered it. Psst. Alphys. Uh, uh, hi. So, the blue lasers... Uh, I mean, Alpha's here. Hi! The blue lasers won't hurt you if you don't move. The orange ones, uh, you have to be moving. And they... Um, they won't, um... Move through those ones. Mm. Uh, bye! <laughs> bye, Alpha's. OMG, I did it! Claws haven't shook like this since Undyne called me to ask about the weather. Oh my gosh, Alphys. Alphys is just an awkward little bean. Wait, there's no weather down here. Why did she call me? I mean... Oh my gosh. Ow! Oh my gosh, I forgot about these two lasers. Uh. Ooh. Okay, we did it. It's a switch. Alright, there we go. Alfie feeling embarrassed? Yes. If there is one VA I want to meet in person, it would be Joe Zija. Ah, uh, yes! Yes. Absolutely, I would love to meet him in person. They're firing lasers, indeed. Nice dodge, thank you! Crescent, who wouldn't? It's alright, Grima. Oh my god, I forgot to tell them where to go! You pick up me right now. It's a photo of a garbage can with several pink glittery filters over it. The uh, Alpha's here! The... The northern door will stay locked until you s solve the puzzles to the right and left. I... I think you should go to the right first. Oops. No! Really? I forgot about how annoying these things are. There we go. All right, to the right. Wonder if it would be unfun if I explain the puzzle. All right, yeah, these puzzles. Okay. There we go. Pretty easy. There we go. Alpha's ear! Th that blue laser seems totally impassable. But, but as the royal scientist, I have some tricks up my sleeve. Uh, I'll hack into the Hotland laser database and take it out. Thank you, Alphys. That was a little conveniently placed, though. We'll say. There we go. I'm mean, giving the answer to a puzzle would ruin the fun. Yeah, that's true. That would that would ruin the fun of the puzzle. All right, we did it though. All right. Amateurs. Hey, amateurs indeed. We solved the puzzle, no problem. Remember, you can always call Pat for assistance. That's true. Miki, welcome in! Whatever, I'll just explain it. Uh, I think I'm, uh... Hey, about the puzzles to the left and right. They're a bit difficult to explain, but... Uh, 
You already s solved them? Awesome! We got this, Alfie. Don't worry. Oh! Here we go. Here we go. Yes, Undertale. <laughs> hey, it's kind of dark in there, isn't it? Uh, don't worry. I'll hack into the light system and brighten it up. Oh, no. Oh, yes. Welcome, beauties, to the Underground's premiere cooking show. Hi, Metaton. <laughs> uh, cooking with a killer robot. Reheat your ovens, because we've got a very special recipe for you today. Congrats on the three-stream stream, Miki! We're going to be making a cake. My lovely assistant here will gather the ingredients. Everyone give them a big hand. <laughs> Let her cook. We'll need sugar, milk, and eggs. Go for it, sweetheart. You found the eggs. You found the milk. You found the sugar. Perfect. Great job, beautiful. We've got all of the ingredients we need to bake the cake. Milk, sugar, eggs. Oh my, wait a magnificent moment. How could I forget? We're missing the most important ingredient. A human soul. Hello, I'm kind of in the middle of something here. W wait a second! Couldn't you make a... Couldn't you use a... Couldn't you make a substitution in the recipe? A substitution? You mean use a different non-human ingredient? Why? Uh, what if someone's... Um... Vegan? <laughs> vegan. Oh, well, I mean... That's a brilliant idea, Alphys. Actually, I happen to have an option right here. MTT brand, always convenient human soul-flavored substitute. A can of which is just which are over with which are on that counter. Well, darling, why don't you go get it? Oh, boy. Frisk is just unfazed. At this point... We're used to it. So we shouldn't expect any less. Oh. Oy! By the way, our show runs on a strict schedule. If you can't get the can in the next one minute, we'll just have to go back to the original plan. So better start climbing, beautiful. Oh no! There's not enough time to climb up! Unfortunately, I might have a plan. When I was upgrading your phone, I added a few features. You see that huge button that says Jetpack? Watch this. Conveniently placed phone jetpack. There! You should have just enough fuel to reach the top. Now get up there. Alright, here goes. Whoa! Manaton, what the heck? Ah. Goodness gravy. Ah. Whoa. Ow. Alright, let's see how fast we can get up there is the question. Ah. Ow, ow, ow. That hurt. Here we go. Here we go. Ah. Uh. Ah. Uh. No. Ah. Did I make it? Oh, I made it. My, my. It seems you've bested me. But only because you had the help of the brilliant Dr. Alphys. Oh, I'm loath to think what would have happened to you without her. 
Well, toodles. Oh yes, about the substitution. Haven't you ever seen a cooking show before? I already baked the cake ahead of time, so forget about it. Amazing, mission complete. Oh, you did it! Wow, we... we did it! We... we really did it! Great job out there, team! Well, uh, anyway, let's keep heading forward. Alright, there's the core. An ominous structure looms in the distance. You're filled with determination. Mm. Oh boy. S see that building in the distance? And that's the core, the source of all power for the underground. It converts geothermal energy into magical energy by... Uh, anyway, that's where we're going to go. In the core is an elevator directly to Asgore's castle. And from there, you can go home. Alright. Well, that's where we headed. Oh my gosh. We're about to see it. What color does the L stand for? <laughs> what color does the L stand for? I think I went the wrong way, though. Fun fact, the core is not ah, any core. No. It's the literal heart on the Undertale title. Oh! I'm not joking. Oh! Well, that's cool. Oh, hey, Sans. Hey, buddy. What's up? Wanna buy a hot dog? It's only 30G. Sure, why not? Thanks, kid. Here's your dog. Yeah, dog. A apostrophe dog. It's short for hot dog. Thanks, Sans. Thank you, Sans. Dinner with the girlfriend! It's a picture of a cat girl figurine next to a bowl of instant noodles. Cool Skeleton 95 posted a picture. Are we posting hot pics? Here's me and my cool friend. It's a picture of Papyrus and flexing in front of a mirror. He's wearing sunglasses. Giant muscular biceps are pasted onto his arms. The biceps are also wearing sunglasses. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh, hi, Rope. Hi, D DBZ. Alright, hi, Rope. Crank up the thermostat. Pyro begins to get excited. Oh gosh. Bombs! <gasps> Alright, we keep turning the heat up. You crank up the thermostat. It's super hot. Pyro looks satisfied. Ow! Alright, leave. <laughs> Oh, cool skeleton 95. That's a joke, right? The only joke here is how strong my muscles are. Oh my goodness, Pappy. DBZ, thank you for redeeming sing mode. H Hi, it's Dr. Alphys. This puzzle is kind of, um, timing based. You see those switches over there? You'll have to press all three of them within three seconds. I'll try to help you with the rhythm. Okay, what would you, uh... What would you like to hear on your... Oh, come on. Alphys. Alphys, you ruined it. Whoa! Looks like you only needed to press two of them. No, Alphys, you just... Okay, never mind. Oh boy. That's the last time I try to help with a puzzle. Alright. Uh, hey! I'm going to the bathroom, so I'll be MIA for a bit. I'm... I'm sure you can handle this puzzle yourself. Thanks, Elphus. There we go. 
here. Here. Let's see. There we go, got it. Uh, Tales of Vesperia OP. Critical thinking off. is the key to success. <laughs> Thank you for the latent praise, Deck God. Tales of Vesperia OP, start off with Adamo Yan Yanni, all the way to Sagasuyo. Oh my gosh. You're making me look up the lyrics because <laughs> I have to remember where that part is. Opening lyrics. And this is the Japanese opening, so. Let's see where I can find it. I made it short. Yeah, no, that's no worries, DBZ. I just gotta remember where it is in the song. That's all. Okay, so where are we starting at? Where? I see Asamoyani, but I don't see... I think I see where you're talking about. Okay. All right, then let me uh, let me do that then. Um ba ba da 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 da. da. Morning, Jerem. Good morning. Hope you're doing well. Hold on, I'm about to sing real quick. Let me do that real quick. Oh my gosh! Ancient player! Ordinary, welcome in! Incoming raid from an ordinary welcome and shine ordinary player with one and viewers. Raiders. Welcome. welcome in. Hope you're doing well today, Ordinary. How was the stream? How did it go? Hope that everything went well. Alright, here we go. Okay, here we go. Asamoya niko de masu ru kane to kunai so to kuanai kimi ga kimi ra shiku a ru koto sole wa mata kodo kudo mo iu hikari wa kage no kage wa hikari no there you go. Raiders, you got a little treat there with the sing mode this time. <laughs> Oh my Let's goodness. Dance. Oh, and a dance time as well. Oh my gosh. Guys, we do need to progress sometime. All right. Dance time it is then. Let's do Let's do number 3. Run into, welcome in. I do need to progress a little bit though. So I'm not just- oh! OMG! People think New Mew 2 is better than New Mew 1? Oh my gosh. I get this 
distracted. Alright. Woo! Dance. Thank you for the dance time, Redeem. Hold on, let me turn the music back on. Alright. Lol, that's a joke, right? Oh my gosh, Alphys. What is happening? Knowing the mouse might one day hack the computerized safe and get the cheese. It fills you with determination. Alright, let's keep going. LMG, don't they get it ruins Mew Mew's entire character arc? My Mew Mew 2 review. Mew Mew Kissy Cutie 2 is neither kissy nor cutie. It's trash. Zero stars. Oh my gosh, Alphys. Goodness gravy, Alphys. Oh, look, Professor. There's something on the passenger seat. <laughs> okay, then. Hold on. Guess I'm gonna have to call my friend back. All right. Luke, it's your turn. You're up, buddy. <laughs> oh. Okay, hold on. Hold on. Let me get him over here. Uh, if I can... Boop. I'll have to... Give me a sec. Okay. Oh. Here I am. Okay, so... I don't... Am I doing this right? Hello, everyone. Hello. Alright. Oh, is it Road Ninja? Goodbye, then. Thank you for saying... For stopping by. The return of the king. I am by no means a king, deck god. Hello there. Uh. Let's see. Uh. What? Uh, hey, you. Stop. Stop what? Oh no. We've like received an anonymous tip about a human wearing a striped shirt. They told us they were wandering around Hotland right now. I know. Sounds scary, huh? Well, just stay chill. We'll bring you someplace safe, okay? Huh? What is it, bro? The shirt they're wearing. Like, what about it? Bro. Are you thinking... What is it with people saying bro? I don't entirely get that. Are you thinking what I'm thinking? Bummer. This is, like, mega embarrassing. We, like, actually totally have to kill you and stuff. Oh, goodness! I didn't expect to be thrown into a fight right away. You attempt to touch our RJ01's armor. Your hands slip off. Ow. What in the world? What is your movements? You clean RJO2's armor. Its cooling dirt begins to wash away. I'm thirsty. Thank you for the hydrate. Alright, I guess we gotta clean the armor. Clean the armor, okay. Ow! Can't take it! Armor! Too hot! Whoa! Please put your shirt back on. Please put your shirt back on. Please. RJ01 looks bothered by something. You tell RJ01 to be honest about his feelings. Oh. Oh dear. Oh no. D dude. I can't. I can't take this anymore. Not like this. Like, O2. I like... 
I like like you. Bro. Alright then, this is getting strange. The way you fight, the way you talk. I love doing team attacks with you. I love standing here with you, pouncing and waving our weapons in sync. Okay then. Oh two. I like want to stay like this forever. Uh I mean uh It's like gotcha bro. Haha. Uh -huh. Oh one. Yeah, bro. Do you want to get some ice cream after this? Sure, dude. <laughs> o1 and O2 are, lo O2 are looking at each other happily. Goodness, thank you for reading that one, Aria. Oh, goodness gracious. I mean, I'm happy that they're happy, but... Goodness me, that was not something that I expected to see. Oh dear. Well, I think that's been enough for me. <laughs> Alrighty, well, I better go. I better bring Arya back. Later, everybody! And I'm back. <laughs> Alrighty. Poor Luke, he had to see that. <laughs> Poor Luke had to see that. I feel so bad. Oops, wait, how's the human doing? Top 10 shows that make you forget to do your freaking job. I'm thirsty. Thank you for the hydrate. No, it's not a bad scene, it's just... The guy taking the shirt off in front of a child thing, you know. You know what I mean. I forgot that uh, one of the guys took their armor off. I forgot about that. Arya, you should have seen Luke. He was so brave. Our boy is all grown up. <laughs> oh my gosh. Alright, let's see. Franking Frank Franking Oh my goodness Franking welcome in welcome welcome But you gotta do your schoolwork you gotta be responsible Ring Okay I'm back uh, another dark room huh Don't worry M my hacking skills have got things covered are you serious? Oh, yes! Good evening, beauties and gentle beauties. This is Metaton, reporting live from MTT News. An interesting situation has arisen in the Eastern Heartland. Fortunately, our correspondent is out there reporting live. Brave correspondent, please find something newsworthy to report. Our ten wonderful viewers are waiting for you. Oh my gosh. A dog. What a sensational opportunity for a story. I can see the headline now. A dog exits, uh, exists somewhere. Frankly, I'm blown away. Support this one? Hmm. Let's look. Oh my, it's a present, and it's addressed to you, darling. I'm guessing this is a pacifist run? Yes, we're aiming for a pacifist run. Aren't you just bursting with excitement? What could be inside? Well, no time like the present to find out. Sure. Attention viewers, our correspondent has found a present. And it's time for the unboxing video. Let's find out what's inside. That round black shape. Could it be? Looks like Christmas came early this year. It's Santa gave people bombs instead of presents. Really though, a bomb. What a thoughtful gift. They even decided to light it for you. But don't get too excited. You haven't even seen the rest of the room yet. 
Oh my. It seems everything in this area is actually a bomb. That dog is a bomb. That basketball's a bomb. Even my words are. <laughs> Brave correspondent. If you don't defuse all of the bombs, this big bomb will blow you to smithereens in two minutes. Goodness gracious, what the heck? It is funny. When you won't be report, then you won't be reporting live any longer. How terrible. How disturbing. How nine viewers are going to love watching this. Good luck, darling. D don't worry. I installed a bomb diffusing program on your phone. Use the diffuse option when the bomb is in the diffuse zone. Now go get him. All right. Diffuse the dog. Diffuse failed. Aim for the diffuse zone. The dog is still active. Got him. Dog diffused. Great job. Now keep heading around the room. Try to go for the one in the bottom left, Dex. Everything in this room is a freaking bomb. Diffuse the game. Got it. Mom diffused. Question, have you ever watched the 90s X-Men? Uh, no. Alright. Let me hear basketball. There we go. Bomb diffused. Alright, now we have to get all of these... Present? Okay. Okay, bomb defused. Hey! Ooh. Ten seconds left! seconds left. Great job! Head for the center! I'm using, uh, camp fields to trap the glass of water there. Alright, come on. Get the glass of water. Alright. Oh no! Too bad, darling. You failed to defuse all of the bombs within three minutes. Now the big bomb is going to blow you to smithereens. Ready, viewers, here comes the moment you've all been waiting for. Huh? Ah. It seems the bomb isn't going off. That's be because while you were monologuing, I I th fixed um I change Oh no, you deactivated the bomb with your hacking skills. Yeah, that's what I did. Curses. It seems I've been foiled again. Curse you, human. Curse you, Dr. Alphys, for helping so much. But I don't curse my eight wonderful viewers for tuning in. Until next time, darling. B boy that was close, huh? I guess a little closer than I would have liked. I should have given you better directions. And there just, just wasn't enough time. But, well, that's Metaton's fault, not mine. I, I can't second guess myself now. I'm f finally starting to feel confident about g guiding you. I'll protect you from that mean old robot, n no matter what. If I have to, I'll even turn... Um, uh, never mind. W we're over the halfway to the core. Let's go! Alright. And this is the part where Alfie and MC stick their tongue out at Metaton. Absolutely. That's 
Let's go dark. All right, here we go. Um, I noticed you've been kind of quiet. Are you worried about meeting Asgore? Well, don't worry, okay? The, the king is a really nice guy. I'm sure you can talk to him and with your human soul, you can pass through the barrier. So, so no worrying, okay? To just forget about it and smile. Right, that's... That's exactly what we'll do, Alphys. Alright. Please select a location. Left 4-3. Alright, let's do this. Oh, I know where we are. I know where we are. Welcome to our party, dearie. Interested in some spider pastries? All proceeds go to real spiders. Oh, yeah. Yeah, no. I forgot. <laughs> no. Nope. Hi, Alpha's here. This room is like the room we saw before. There are two puzzles to the north and south. You'll have to solve them both before proceed. Also, I'd like to say, I don't really like giving away puzzle solutions. But if you need help, just call me, okay? Actually, wait. I have an idea. Let's be friends on Undernet. Then you can just ping me when you need help. Wait, we're already friends, aren't we? I signed you up, didn't I? You have been reading my posts the whole time. Well, I hope you'll agree with me about Mew Mew too. <laughs> oh my goodness. What YouTuber made Alpha sound like the guy who plays Terminator slash Mr. Freeze? Huh? I don't know. I didn't know there was a, VTu a YouTuber that did that. Oh. Sundar plane attacks, not because it's jealous. Right. Totally not because it's jealous. There we go. I love Alphys because Alphys just reminds me of me sometimes. Critical thinking is the key to success. Thank you for the praise, the latent praise. All right, let's see. There and there, good. All right, whee! Oh no. Ow! That hurt. Hey! This is, um... It doesn't have anything to do with you, but... Uh, hey. Would you want to watch a human TV show together? Sometime? It's called, um... Mew Mew Kissy Cutie. Sure! W really? It's so good! It's um, my favorite show. It's all about this human girl named Mimi with cat ears. Oh my gosh, Alphys, you're rambling. Oh my gosh. Uh. Alphys. 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 That was a lot, Alphys. <laughs> we should watch it after you get through all this. Calm down, Alphys. All right, puzzle time. There we go. At least rambling isn't as bad as some people we know. Yeah, that's true. 
At least it's not Wendy old bag. All right, let's see. All right, go through the door. Ta-da! All right, we're, oh. Oh no, hold on. Wait, where's the box? Oh no, where's the box? I need to get the, the I need to get back to my box. Hold on. Oh no. I need to get back to my to the box. I forgot something. I forgot something. What? Yeah, I forgot something. Hold on. I need to go back down. I need to go back down. Pokemon gym level design be like. Be like what? Do you not have the phone boxes? Oh wait! Hold on, dimensional box. Oh yeah, I do! Yay! I forgot about that. Never mind. Never mind. I forgot. Dimensional boxes. Thank you, Franking. Thank you for reminding me about the dimensional boxes. <laughs> oh my goodness. I I forgore. I forgot about the dimensional boxes. Now I have to get through this again. No, I didn't want to do that. That room? Oh, yes. This will help us. The smell of cobwebs fills the air. You're filled with determination. Franking Sucker joins the guild. Franking, thank you so much for that follow and welcome to the Shade Slayer Guild. Welcome in. All right. <laughs> Did you hear what they just said? They said a human wearing a striped shirt will come through. I heard that they hate spiders. I heard that they love to stomp on them. I heard that they like to tear their legs off. I heard. That they're awfully stingy with their money. <laughs> you think your taste is too refined for our pastries, don't you, dearie? <laughs> I disagree with that notion. I think your taste is exactly what this next batch needs. Hi, Muffet! Muffet traps you. Alright. Don't look so blue, my dearie. Oh, here we go. I think purple is better look on you. <laughs> You're trapped in a strange purple web. Why so pale? You should be proud. Alright. Muffet pours you a cup of spiders. Proud that you're going to make a delicious cake. <laughs> ah! Oh my gosh. Let you go? Don't be silly. Your soul is going to make every spider very happy. Ah! Ow! Hold on. Hold on, where's the donut? There's the donut. You ate the spider donut. Your HP was maxed out. Huh? Where did you get that? Did you steal it? 
Oh, my pet. It's time to show them what we do with these. Huh? A telegram from the spiders in the ruins? What? They're saying that they saw you and... You helped donate to their cause. Oh my, this has all been a big misunderstanding. I thought you were someone that hated spiders. The person who asked for that soul. They must have meant a different human in a striped shirt. Sorry for all the trouble. <laughs> I'll make it up to you. You can come back here anytime and for no charge at all. I'll wrap you up and let you play with my pet again. <laughs> Just kidding. I'll spare you now. All right, there we go. That was easy. <laughs> that was fun. See you again, dearie. And this is why you buy the spider donut. Why you buy the spider donut? <sighs> Otherwise, you have to deal with that fight, and it's probably one of the most annoying fights. It's a poster for Metaton's latest stage performance. A tragic tale of two star-crossed lovers kept apart by the tides of fate. Looks like it's almost time for the performance. All right, it is time for the performance. Oh dear. Aria, there are cars in the underground. Um. Oh. Oh, that human. <laughs> oh, here we go. Could it be? My one true love. Here we go. <laughs> here we go. King forbids your stay. Humans must fly far apart, even if it breaks my heart. They only let you into the dungeon. Goodness gravy. Sad. You're gonna die. Cry, cry, cry. Oh, sad it's happening. <laughs> you have a nice singing voice. Thank you, Franking. <laughs> that was really bad, I think, though. So sad. So sad that you're going to the dungeon. Well, toodles. Bye. Oh no, whatever shall I do? My love has been cast away into the dungeon. A dungeon with a puzzle so dastardly, my paramour will surely perish. Oh, heavens have mercy, the horrible color tiled maze. Each color tile has its own sadistic function. For example, a green tile sounds a noise and then you must fight a monster. Red tiles will... Actually, wait a second. Didn't we see this puzzle about a hundred rooms ago? That's right. You remember all the rules, don't you? Great. Then I won't waste your time repeating them. Oh, and you'd better hurry. Because if you don't get through within 30 seconds... You'll be incinerated by these jets of fire! Ha 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 ha! My poor love, I'm filled with grief. I can't stop laughing. Good luck, darling. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Ah! I'm not gonna make it, that's okay. Nope, 
did not make it. Oh, I'm sorry. It looks like you're out of time. Here come the flames, darling. They're closing in. Getting closer. Oh my. Any minute now. <clears throat> Watch out! I'll save you! I'm backing. I'm hacking into the firewall right now. Oh my gosh. Oh no! How could this happen? Foiled again by the brilliant Dr. Alphys. That... That's right! Come on, Metaton! Give up already! You'll never be able to defeat us. Not as long as we work together. Your puzzle's over. Now go home and leave us alone. Puzzle? Over? Alphys, darling, what are you talking about? Did you forget what the green tiles do? They make a sound and then you have to fight a monster. Well, darling, that monster is me. All right, Metaton fight two. This is it, darling. Say goodbye. Is that your phone? You'd better answer it. Hey, this seems bad, but don't worry. There's one last thing I installed on your phone. You see that yellow button? Go to this phone's app menu and press it. Yellow. You press the yellow button. The phone is resonating with Metaton's presence. Oh, that yellow glow. Ooh. Now press Z. There you go. Pew pew. Oh. Oh, you've defeated me. How can this be? You were stronger than I thought. Whatever. We're firing lemons? Oh, it looks like you beat him. You did a really great job out there. All thanks to you. What? No, oh, no, I mean... You were the one doing everything cool. I just wrote some silly programs for your phone. Um, hey. This might sound strange, but... Can I tell you something? Before I met you, I didn't really... I didn't really like myself very much. For a long time, I felt like a total screw-up. Like I couldn't do anything without... without ending up letting everyone down. But, but... Guiding you has made me feel... a lot better about myself. So, thanks for letting me help you. Uh, anyway, we're almost to the core. It's just past Ed TT Resort. Come on, let's finish this. All right. To the core. To the core. Oh, hey, Sans. Hey, heard you're going to the core. How about grabbing some dinner with me first? Uh, yeah. Great, thanks for treating me. Over here. I know a shortcut. Alright. Oh, this is one of my favorite tracks right here. Well, here we are. So, the journey's almost over, huh? You must really want to go home. Hey, I know the feeling, buddo. Though, maybe sometimes it's better to take what's given to you. Down here, you've already got food, drink, friends. Is what you have to do really worth it? <sighs> ah, forget it. I'm rooting for you, kid. Hey. Let me tell you a story. I'm a sentry in Snowden Forest, right? I sit out there and watch for humans. It's kind of boring. Fortunately, deep in the forest, there's this huge locked door. I wonder what that door is. And it's perfect for practicing knock-knock jokes. So one day, I'm knocking them out, like usual. I knock on the door and say knock-knock. And suddenly, from the other side, 
a year old woman's voice. Who is there? Don't actually I'll respond. There she is. There she is who? This is a very bad joke. And she just howls with laughter. Like it's the best joke she's heard in a hundred years. So I kept them coming. And she keeps laughing. She's the best audience that I've ever had. Then after a dozen of them, she knocks and says, Knock, knock. I say, who's there? Old lady. Old lady who? Oh, I did not know you could yodel. Wow. Needless to say, this woman was extremely good. We kept telling each other jokes for hours. Eventually, I had to leave. Virus gets kind of cranky without his bedtime story. She told me to come by again, so I did. Then I did again, and again. It's a thing now. Telling bad jokes through the door. It rules. One day, though, no, I noticed she wasn't laughing very much. I asked her what was up. She told me something strange. If a human ever comes through this door, could you please, please promise something? Watch over them and protect them, will you not? Now, I hate making promises. And this woman, I don't even know her name. It's fine. Someone who sincerely likes bad jokes has an integrity you can't say no to. Do you get what I'm saying? That promise I made to her. You know what would have happened if she hadn't said anything? Buddy. You'd be dead where you stand. Mm. Hey, lighten up, bucko. I'm just joking with you. Besides, haven't I done a great job protecting you? I mean, look at yourself. You haven't died a single time. Hey. What's that look supposed to mean? Am I wrong? <laughs> well, that's all. Take care of yourself, kid. If someone really cares about you. He also couldn't kill even if he wanted to. That's true. Hmm. I'm the resort comedian. I'm very funny. People laugh at my jokes. Now my son, he wants to be a comedian like his father. But his jokes aren't funny. He tells these awful puns. He's an embarrassment to our family. Ah, that's not funny. Since his mother passed on, he couldn't stand living at home anymore. So he ran away. Haven't seen him since. I'm thirsty. I'm a terrible father. Uh, that's not funny. Goodness gracious. Alright. I love how Sans' voice changed its pitch for our lady friend. Yeah, that was awesome. The relaxing atmosphere of this hotel. It fills you with determination. All right, I want to take my break real quick now that we've reached the hotel and we'll be going on to the core momentarily then. I'll be right back, everybody. BRB! Thank you. 
All right, I'm back. All righty. Let me make sure, let me buy a cup, maybe buy some food real quick. Buy a glam burger as well. There we go. Hello, hello. All right. To the core. Huh? Who are they? B nobody else is supposed to be here. Oh well, we can can't worry about that now. Alphys, what the heck? Ready? This is it. Take the elevator up to the top of the core. The elevator isn't working. What? The elevator should be working. Well then, go to the right and keep heading up. Huh? Oh. Alright, now just keep heading up. That pit. It, this isn't on my map. Forget it. Let's try the left side. Ah, the core music. Okay, you should be able to make it through here. W watch out! Oh gosh. Fight time! You ignore magic and think of pollen and sunshine. Your defense increased by one. Ooh! Oh! Did I do it? Am I doing the right thing? I don't know if I'm doing the right thing or not. Ow! Magic whispers arcane swear words. The unrelenting chaser orb was weakened by your glare. The intimidated corner orb was weakened by your stare. Okay, here we go. Oh. Magic's orbs are incapacitated. All right, there we go. Th that was close. Wh why are there so many monsters here? I mean, it's no problem, r right? We've just got to keep heading forward. All right, let's keep going. Well, looks like you can't proceed until you hit the switch. But, but, those lasers will activate when you do. Um, it looks like they'll come in this order. Orange, orange, blue. Got it? Move it till the third one. Oh! Arya uses the smooth jams to smoothly dodge. Well, I try. This is like one of my favorite OSTs. Oh my god, are you hurt? I... I'm so sorry. I, I gave you the wrong order. Everything's going to be fine, okay? Let's just keep heading to the right. Uh, crossroads. Uh... Uh... T try heading to the right. Well, wait. No, I think you should head up. Uh, huh? I... I guess this was the right way. M more lasers? Okay, I... I won't mess around this time. I'll just deactivate the lasers and let you through. They're... They're not turning off. I can't turn them off. I... It's okay. I have this under control. I'm going to turn off the power to the whole node. Then you can walk across. Okay, go. Wait, stop! The power! It's turning itself back on! Th darn it! This isn't supposed to happen! I... I'm gonna turn it off again! 
When it turns off, move a little and then stop. Okay, you won't get her hurt. Ooh. Ooh. There we go. So see, I've got everything under control. Everything's under control. Right, Alphys, under control. Okay, you should, you should, I don't know. This doesn't look like my map at all. I'm sorry, I, I, I have to go. And Alphys leaves us. The air is filled with the smell of ozone. It fills you with determination. What does ozone smell like? Oh, I'm sorry to hear that, Chevy. I hope things will get better for you. There's 100G inside the trash can. Will you take it? You got 100G. All right. Freaking ghost ghosting around. Oh my gosh. Okay, here we go. Oh boy. Oh. Feel better, Chevy. You kneel and pray for safety. Wins a lot, remembers it's conscious. Ow! Wins a lot, doesn't want to fight anymore. Woof. Ah! Frog! You were intimidated by Final Frog. It. You did something mysterious. Final Frog, it recognizes it has a lot more to learn from this world. Luxy! Welcome in! Hi! Do we have a shout out for Luxy, please? Welcome in! It's good to see you! How are you doing? Thoughtful croak. Ooh! Final Frog, it seems reluctant to fight you. Oh! I missed! Oh, thank goodness! Oh! 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 That's the second time that that's happened. That is the second time that that has happened like that. Oh! Nearly had a panic attack. Oh, I'm sorry you have a headache, Luxie. Hope you feel better. Mercenaries emerge from the shadows. All right. Farewell. Oh. Ow, ow! Night, night breathes deeply. Hmm. You sing an old lullaby. Night, night starts looking sleepy. Oh, goodness. Ow! Ow! Oh, no. You eat the hot dog? Your HP was maxed out. Oh, goodness. Oh, no. Uh. Ow! You keep singing. Night Night closes its eyes a bit. Ow! Oh, my gosh. Ow! <laughs> night Night smashes her morning star. You keep singing. Night Night falls asleep. Oh my goodness. Alright. We're gonna stare at the chaser orb. The unrelenting chaser orb was weakened by your glare. Yes, Night Night is asleep. We should be okay for a while. Ooh. The intimidating corner orb was weakened by your glare. Okay. Oh, goodness. Pulling the sneak attack on a frog. No, the problem is I don't want to attack the frog. All right, spare them both. Okay. Ooh, okay. All right, one more. Oh no, what a nightmare! Right. Ow! Oh no. 
Ooh, no, that ain't good. That ain't good. You eat the glam burger. Uh, can you flee? No. Not from not from these fights, I don't think. I don't think. Let's see. You pick on astigmatism. How dare you? <gasps> and I'm dead. All right, well, oopsies. That's our second death, I think. That's our second death. I mean, we haven't been doing too badly. We haven't had that many, as many deaths as I thought. Yeah, this is only our second death. All right, now I know exactly what to do though, so. Hey, Neil of Ray. Ow! Goodness. Flies. Ow! Oh no, oh no. <laughs> Mr. Fly, please don't kill me. Oh goodness. Uh, 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 uh. No! Ah! 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 Okay. Item. I died so many times here. I got 10 HP. Okay. I understand. I put Night Night to sleep. So that we don't die here. Ow! Okay, come on. Oh! Okay. Night Day falls asleep. Okay. They stare at the herbs. Okay. Ooh. Huh? Ah! Ah! Oh my gosh. Ah! All right. And then the corner orb. Okay. I am literally trying not to panic here right now. Oh. According to the judgment of the oratrice okay. mechanique Denise Cardinal. We now turn to the Oratrice Mechanique Denalise Cardinal. The Oratrice Mechanique Denalise Cardinal, uh, I can barely hear that right now. <sighs> Eat the hot dog. Alright, let's go. Calm down? What do you mean, calm down? I'm trying not to die. <gasps> you kneel and pray for safety. He wins a lot. Get rid of... Limbs a lot first. Uh, ooh. Okay, here we go. Ooh. And now that whims a lot is out of there. Uh. And then we'll mystify frog it. Okay. Yes, I know that. I know that it's best to remain calm, but you know you can't help it. You've seen enough. Okay. All right, don't pick on. You don't pick on astigmatism. What are you so afraid of? Huh? What do you mean? Wait, do we have to challenge it? Let's try to challenge it. You dare defy me? Oh my gosh. Wait, what in the world? Take your last look. Oh my gosh. How do you... How do you get... Oh my gosh. How do you get around this thing? How in the world do you get around this thing? How in 
in the world? You pick on astigmatism. That's right. Wait, that's right? Oh, ah! Okay, there we go. <sighs> Got through it. We did it. All right. All right. Now the laser is removed. I'm down this way. I think. Okay, now I gotta remember where I'm supposed to go here. Oh yeah, here we go. Oh. Okay, nope. Pick on me. Oh. Oh. Ah, okay. So... He said pick on me, so pick on him. You pick on astigmatism. That's right, okay. We did what you asked. Now let me go, please. Okay, and 50 gold, yay. Oh goodness. All right, hold on. Yeah, I'm gonna buy some more food real quick. You're filled with determination, hold on. I'm gonna go down the elevator real quick. All right, here we go. All right, hold on. I'm gonna buy some food real quick so that I don't die. Let's see. Oh my gosh. Let's do... Let's buy one of these and then two glam burgers and then another one of these. Oh, and then... And one more. Because we need to have some money. Alright. There you go. We will get there, don't worry. We just need to buy some food. Hold on. Alright, bye, Mega Rock. Hope you have a great rest of your day at class. Stay sharp. Alright, here we go. Behind this door must be the elevator to the king's castle. You're filled with determination. All right, hold on. There we go. All right, it is time. Oh, yes. There you are, darling. It's time to have our little showdown. It's time to finally stop the malfunctioning robot. Not malfunction. Reprogramming. Get real. This was all just a big show. An act. Alphys has been playing you for a fool the whole time. <gasps> no! As she watched you on the screen, she grew attached to your adventure. She desperately wanted you to wanted to be a part of it. So she decided to insert herself into your story. She reactivated puzzles, disabled elevators. She enlisted me to torment you. All so she could save you from dangers that don't exist. Also, that you would think she's the great person. Oop. That she's not. And now, it's time for her finest hour. At this very moment, Alphys is waiting outside the room. During our battle, she will interrupt. She will pretend to deactivate me, saving you one final time. She'll be the heroine of your adventure. She'll regard her so highly, she'll even be able to convince you not to leave. Or not. You see, I've had enough of this predictable charade. I've no desire to harm humans from it. I desire humans. Far from it, actually. My only desire is to entertain. After all, the audience deserves a good show, don't they? And what's a good show without a plot twist? Sorry, folks. The old program's been cancelled. But we've got a finale that will drive you wild. Oh, here we go. Real drama, real action, real bloodshed. On our new show, Attack of the Killer Robot. It is time. Metaton attacks. Metaton. Attack 30, defense 245. Seriously, his metal body is invulnerable. 
Yes, I was the one that rearranged the core. I was the one that hired everyone to kill you. That, however, was a short-sighted plan. You know what would be a hundred times better? Killing you myself. That worthless pea shooter won't work on me, darling. Don't you understand what acting is? Metaton. Listen, darling, I've seen you fight. You're weak. If you continue forward, Asgore will take your soul. Yeah, this fight is so good. And with your soul, Asgore will destroy humanity. Ow! But if I get your soul, I can stop Asgore's plan. I can save humanity from destruction. Oh, that was great. All right, use the star fey. Then using your soul, I'll cross through the barrier and become the star I've always dreamed of being. Hundreds, thousands, no, millions of humans will watch me. Oh, I forgot about the bombs. Ooh. Blitz glamour, I finally have it all. So what if a few people have to die? That's show business, baby. Uh, I can't see what's going on in there, but don't give up, okay? So there's one last way to beat Metaton. It's, um, it's... This is a work in progress, so don't judge it too hard. But you know how Metaton always faces forward? That's because there's a switch on his backside. So, so if you can turn him around, um, and um, press the, the, that switch, he'll be, um, he'll be vulnerable. Well, you gotta go. Seems like a good time to turn Metaton around. You tell Metaton that there's a mirror behind him. Oh, a mirror? Right, I have to look perfect for our grand finale. Hmm, I don't see it. Where is it? Oh! Did you just flip my switch? Oh! It is. Oh, yes. <laughs> it is time! It's time! Oh my. If you flipped my switch, that can only mean one thing. You're desperate for the premiere of my new body. How rude. Luckily for you, I've been aching to show this off for a long time. So, as thanks, I'll give you a handsome reward. I'll make your last living moments... Absolutely beautiful. Alright, here we go. You the pose. You pose dramatically. The audience nods. Lights, camera, action. Ow. I forgot about that. You ate the star fake. The audience loves the brand. Your HP was maxed out. Marsh, welcome in. Metaton. You pose dramatically. Ooh! Okay. Violence. You turn and scoff at the audience. They're rooting for your destruction this turn. Ow! Justice. Oh, goodness. Glam burger? You eat the glam burger. The audience loves the brand. Your HP was maxed out. Hi, Marsh! It's time for a pop quiz. I hope you brought a keyboard. This one's an easy question, an essay question. Just start typing. What do you love most about Metagar? Oh, you said so much about me. I love how passionate you are. Even though I don't understand what you said. Metaton is saving your essay for future use. <laughs> oh my gosh. You say you aren't going to get hit at all. 
Ratings gradually increased during Metaton's turn. Your essay really showed everyone your heart. Why don't I show you mine? Ow! I forgot about that! Ow! Ow! Alright, there we go. Alright, item. Star Fae. Woo! This theme is so good. Oh, I'm just warming up. Woo! There we go. Ooh! Nice! Okay. You say you aren't going to get hurt at all. Rate is gradually increased during Metaton's turn. It is such a good... It is such a good theme. Alright. Ow! Can you keep up the pace? I know. Alright. Um. You eat the glam burger. The audience loves the brand. Yay! And we'll see how this goes. close. <laughs> Welcome, Gray Fox! Pose dramatically. Time for our union regulated break. Woo! Alright. Metaton! Pose dramatically. The audience nods. We've grown so distant, darling. How about another heart to heart? arms fall off. Smells like Metaton. You pose dramatically. The audience nods. Arms? Who needs arms with legs like these? He said the thing. I'm still going to win. Oh, crap. Oh! Oh, that was too close. Alright. Nice. Come on. No! No! My... I touched the edge of the box. No! We were really close. We were really close. Alright. Alright, we're back to this. Seems like you could skip Metaton's monologue by turning him around now. What will you do? Skip. He told Metaton there was something really cool behind him. Really? Where? Clever. Very clever. Alright, here we go. He posed dramatically. The audience nods. Out. All right, here we go. Turn and scoff at the audience, rooting for your destruction. All right. Whoa. All right. Despite being hurt, you pose dramatically. The audience applauds. All right. Okay. Eat the star faith. The audience loves the brand. Yep, yep, yep. Ow. Oh, goodness gracious. Pose. Okay. It's time for a pop quiz. Yep. Hope you're on a keyboard. This type stuff. Uh, 
All right. <laughs> That's right. Legs. What's the correct answer? Oh, I forgot about that. All right. Here we go. Um. We're gonna pose. I have a fun fact for you after you win. Oh dear. All right. Show you. Show you yours. Yep. I know. Ow, 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 ow. <gasps> okay, I did it. Oh, that was a little too close. Star Bay, nice. You missed the chance to get 500 points. What do you mean? What do you mean? What did I do? All right, pose. Pose dramatically. How are you on the dance floor? There we go. All right. There we go. Pose. Can you keep up the pace? Hey, ooh, nice. Okay. Pose dramatically. Audience nods. Here we go. Pose dramatically. Nice. Okay, we did it. All right. Pose dramatically. The audience nods. Regulated break. Woo! Pose dramatically. Road so distant. How about another heart to heart? Ow. No, 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 no. Oh, the arms just fell off. You eat the glam burger. The audience loves the brand. All right. Uh, arms? Who needs arms with legs like these? I'm still going to win. Oh, I remembered it that time. Pose dramatically. Let's see. Here we go. Woo! All right. Pose. Pose dramatically. The audience nods. The show must go on. Ah! I eat the star fay. The audience loves the brand. Nice. The drama, action. All right, did it. Okay. There we go. Woo. Metathon looks like the phrase hands down, literally. L lights, c camera. Enough of this. Do you really want humanity to perish? Or do you just believe in yourself that much? Woo. Okay. Pose dramatically, audience nods. How inspiring. Well, darling, it's either me or you. But I think we both already know who's going to win. Witness the true power of humanity's star. Ah! I forgot about that. The audience loves the brand. Nice. Then, are you the star? Can you really protect humanity? Oh my gosh, okay. Ow! Oh. Alright, alright. Metaton. Pose again. 
You pose dramatically. The audience nods. Oops. Okay. Pose. Despite being hurt, you pose dramatically. The audience applauds. Oh, look at these ratings. This is the most viewers I've ever had. We've reached the viewer call-in milestone. One lucky viewer will have the chance to talk to me before I leave the underground forever. Let's see who calls in first. Hi, you're on TV. What do you have to say on this, our last show? Oh. Hi, Metaton. I really liked watching your show. My life is pretty boring, but seeing you on the screen brought excitement to my life vicariously. I can't tell, but I guess this is the last episode. I'll miss you, Metaton. Oh, I didn't mean to talk so long. Oh. No, wait, wait, look. Oh, they already hung up. I'll take another caller. Metaton, your showmate is so happy! Metaton, I don't know what I'll watch without you. Metaton, there's a Metaton-shaped hole in my Metaton-shaped heart. Ah, uh, I... I see. Everyone, thank you so much. Darling. Perhaps it might be better if I stay here for a while. Humans already have stars and idols, but monsters, they only have me. If I left, the underground would lose its spark. I'd leave an aching void that can never be filled. Yes, I do, Dark. So, I think I'll have to delay my big debut. Besides, you've proven to be very strong. Perhaps even strong enough to get past Asgore. I'm sure you'll be able to protect humanity. Ha, huh, ha. Huh. It's all for the best anyway. The truth is, this form's energy consumption is inefficient. In a few moments, I'll run out of battery power and, well, I'll be alright. Knock em dead, darling. And everyone, thank you. You've been a great audience. <sighs> I... I managed to open the lock! Are you two... Oh... My god... Mango! B -b -b Mango! Welcome in! Metaton! Metaton, are you... Thank God. It's just the batteries. Metaton, if you were gone, I would have. I would have. I mean, hey, it's no problem, you know? He's just a robot. If you mess it up, I could always. just build another. Uh... Why don't you go on ahead? Alright. Onwards we go. S sorry about that. Let's keep going. S so, you're about to meet Asgore, huh? You must be. You must be. Pr pretty excited about all that, huh? You'll finally. You'll finally get to go home. W wait! I mean, um, I. I was just going to, um. say goodbye and. Uh, I can't take this anymore. I. I lied to you. A human soul isn't strong enough to cross the barrier alone. It takes at least a human soul. And a monster soul. 
If you want to go home, you'll have to take his soul. You'll have to kill Asgore. I'm sorry. And that's the sad, awful truth. The sad, awful truth. We have to... We have to kill Asgore. It's really sad. What? What? Indeed. Indeed. Oh, boy. Here we go. Save point. Alright, let's see. We have a passage to go through. Look at this. Welcome to new home. Alright. Up we go. And there's the theme. Alright. The way is blocked by two padlocks. There's a note attached. Howdy! I'm in the garden. If you have anything you need to get off your chest, please don't hesitate to come. The keys are in the kitchen and in the hallway. Alright. To the hallway. It's a golden flower. The place may seem familiar and deep. A long time ago, a human fell into the ruins. Injured by its fall, the human called out for help. You took the key and put it on your phone's keychain. Yeah, this place may seem a little familiar. Azriel, the king's son. Heard the human's call. He brought the human back to the castle. Hmm. Azriel. Should we check the mirror? Over time, Azriel and the human became like siblings. The king and queen treated the human child as their own. The underground was full of hope. Are we ending Undertale today? No. We will not be able to end today. Unfortunately. Because with the boss fight that's after this, there's no way. You unlocked the chain. Then, one day, the human became very ill. The sick human only had one request, to see the flowers from their village, but there was nothing we could do. The next day, the next day, the human died. Azrael, racked with grief, absorbed the human soul. He transformed into a being with incredible power. Yeah, this doesn't look well at all. With the human soul, Azrael crossed through the barrier. He carried the human's body into the sunset. Back to the village of the humans. We're doing, uh, neutral into pacifist. Azriel reached the center of the village. There he found a bed of golden flowers. He carried the human onto it. Suddenly, screams rang out. The villagers saw Azriel holding the human's body. They thought that he had killed the child. All good, Mango. The humans attacked him with everything they had. He was struck with blow after blow. Azriel had the power to destroy them all.
bot. Asriel did not fight back. Clutching the human, Asriel smiled and walked away. Wounded, Asriel stumbled home. He entered the castle and collapsed. His dust spread across the garden. The kingdom fell into despair. The king and queen had lost two children in one night. The humans had once again taken everything from us. Hmm. The king decided it was time to end our suffering. Every human who falls down here must die. With enough souls, we can shatter the barrier forever. It's not long now. King Asgore will save us all. King Asgore will give us hope. King Asgore will let us go. You should be smiling too. Aren't you excited? Aren't you happy? You're going to be free. are in the last corridor which is where we will pick up from next time oh boy goodness gracious it kind of hurts when you realize that this is somewhat of an equivalent to what humans are doing to nature kind of it, I can understand where you're coming from with that zingy <sighs> it's hard to believe. Goodness gracious. It's pretty nuts. This story. But it's so good. Yeah, next time is going to be very eventful. Very eventful. <sighs> we will see. Next time will be the last time. Maybe. We shall see. We shall see. Alrighty. Thank you so much for coming, everybody. Can't stay for the raid, so goodbye for now. No worries, Impulse. Thank you for stopping by. I hope you have a great rest of your day. Stay sharp. Alrighty, though. Thank you so much for coming, everyone. For those who are staying, let us go ahead and find somebody to rage today before we head off. Let's see. Oh! <gasps> Yes, let's see. Lyra is online. Look, yeah, Lyra's online. But also Shades is online. Shades is playing Stardew Valley for an uncapped subathon, I believe. Once there are sufficient records in the database, <laughs> the flow of individuals will link together seemingly independent events. Thank you for the Don Hun line. Yeah. He's doing an uncapped subathon with uh Yuki Scribbles, and they are doing playing Stardew Valley. They're playing the new um uh Stardew Valley farm for the new update. Aria Shadesley is also online. Oh, haha, ha, very funny. <laughs> Alrighty, though. Why don't we give our friend a Shades for Shades array today? Alrighty. If you're headed on over to the raid, be sure to type Shadesley Raid in the chat so that they know that we are there and that we are supporting them. Please do, please do so. Give our friend Shade for Shades, Shades for Shades, some support. Um, hold on. Let me do the no slaying shade. No worries. No worries. Hold on. Let me do the shout out. At Shades for Shades. There we go. Got it, got it, got it. 
Alright. Alrighty. If you're headed on over, be sure to follow all of his rules as you would mine. And once again, as always, have fun. Alrighty. Thank you so much for coming, everybody. Tomorrow, we will be back into Ace Attorney. We'll be back into Justice for All Case 4. We'll see, finally, some true colors come to light here. Hope y'all will be ready for that. <laughs> Alrighty. Thank you so much for coming, everybody, and I will see you all tomorrow. Bye! Stay sharp, Shadeslayers! <laughs>